Hello YouTubers, I'm Parways and this is our 23rd video in Qt5 C++ GUI application development. Uh, in the previous video, we have learned about uh, sequential animations in Qt5. In this video, we are going to create state machines in Qt5 C++. So now let's get started. The first thing I need, I'm going to create a new final project, Qt widget application. And I call it uh, state machine. Uh, next 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 and finish okay now this is our project we have a main window.cpp we have a header.file and also we have our .ui file okay now in the .ui file first i'm going to add a push button and also two push buttons i need and i need a label in here so for the push button i'm going to change state and just change the title to change state like this and for the text uh, current state I'm going to give it one and also you can change the label to a uh, state label like this okay and also I'm going to change the font of my text to the bigger bold now I'm going to make it bigger like this and also this is my other button. after this open your header file now in here we need some ports first we need a Q state machine we need a Q event transition we need a Q property animation for our animation. Okay. Now in the private section, we need to create a state machine object. Q state machine. I call it machine, and I need to create two uh, two states. Uh, Q state. I call it S one, and also Q state I call it s2 after creating two states I want to create a Q property animation now Q property animation and I call it animation so after this I'm going to open my main window.cpp and in the constructor uh, first I need to create my uh, state machine Q state machine and it needs a parameter the parent is this so after this now I'm going to create two uh, states first one is one new Q state after creating our first state we need to assign property for our state so s1 assign property first I'm going to take the uh, my label object name and it is text and give it a current state one okay like this and after this now I'm going to set another uh, assign another property this is for my push button uh, for my push button two, and uh, give it geometry and give a Q rect uh, 50, 200, uh, 150. Okay, now this was our first state. I'm going to create my state 2. Still new uh, Q state. Now assign property. Assign property. Take your label. State label and this is text current state 2 we have state 1 and we have state 2 now also make this for your push button sorry s2 assign property ui push button 2 and geometry 
and the position is I'm going to give it for example 200 and 50 140 and 100 okay now this is our two uh, we have created our machine state we have created our two state Um, now we need to create our animation because uh, we want animation between two states so let me comment uh, create animation now for animation I'm going to create a queue prop up uh, I have animation and new queue property animation okay now uh, in here uh, I'm going to take my push button to and uh, I need to set the geometry for this geometry and uh, yeah like this and now I'm going to create a async curve because uh, uh, if you don't know about async curve I have a video on this you can watch that so uh, animation I want an out bounce easing curve animation uh, set easing curve Q easing curve out bounce you can see we have different kind and I will show you we have out bounce out circ out cubic out curve I want out bounce okay now uh, we have created our machine we have created our two states and we have created our animation now it's time to create our even transition we want to add the even transition to our code so uh, adding even transition transition to the code okay uh, Mm, I, let me check I have created event from no. okay no problem I'm going to create in here uh, Q event uh, transition uh, T1 new uh, Q event uh, Q event transition Q event transition okay now in here you need to add your uh, change uh, change state button so UI change state and uh, Q event I want mouse uh, button press like this okay now after this now you need to uh, set the target state uh, T1 set target state and we want to add our uh, state 2 in here and also t1 add animation we want to add our animation in here okay now this is our even transition 1 now we are going to create even transition 2 q event uh, transition it is uh, t2 new Q event uh, transition because we have two states so for this we need to create two event transition and the UI change state Q event mouse or uh, button press now add this uh, T2 uh, set target state I'm going to set this to S1 and T2 add animation I want to add my animation to this and also add a transition S2 and I forgot that transition for my uh, first one I will add that uh, T2 okay now for this also I'm going to T1 uh, no s1 add transition and my transition is t1 okay 
now this is our code uh, at the end uh, we need to add our these states to our uh, mm, machine so machine add a state s1 mm, machine add a state s2 and the last one you need to set the initial state because we need a set of our initial value so set initial state and I want is s1 okay and after this start your machine okay now this is completed now I'm going to run this hopefully we don't get any error if we get any error we will solve this let me run it save all now I'm going to wait oh, just wait for this yeah now it is uh, completed okay now we have this if I click on this uh, you can see we have in here like this uh, push button one in here if you check change state state 2 and this is state 1 state 2 state 1 state 2 like this okay and uh, and uh, if you change for example uh, let me just show you you can change this to async curve for example this is now outbounds so I want for example elastic so now if I run this you will see I have a different animation for this uh, now I'm waiting for this now if I click on this uh, you can see it's uh, more speedy and if I change to this to for example another out in back let me just run it now if I click on this uh, you can see now it's like in back uh, thank you guys if you have any question please let me know and for the further videos please subscribe to my channel